One of the things that I try to do uh, before a big show is to just kind of get my meditation together. Um, my wife created this wonderful um, prayer closet, war room, if you will, uh, which I started out using uh, pretty much on a daily basis, especially when the kids were going to school. Um, it kind of fell off a little bit, but I still have it and I still use it as needed. But uh, I definitely appreciate this and I use this room to just kind of meditate and to, you know, ask God to just lead me and guide me and to, for him to just... Um, just focus my mind, you know, for, uh, you know, this upcoming show and to just uh, allow me the gifts that he's given me, you know. And so I, I thank God uh, just for uh, this opportunity. And I just use this room to really kind of get in touch with him and to just uh, do my relaxation and to just meditate and to pray, most importantly. So. That's, that's a benefit that I use uh, for this room. Now we're headed to Jacksonville, Florida. Very exciting. I uh, get a chance to work with uh, a great friend uh, by the name of Preacher Lawson. A lot of you all may remember him. He was uh, on America's Got Talent. And uh, he's just... Uh, he was able to just, you know, do his thing, man. And so um, a lot of people don't know that, you know, he was on tour with us, you know, so funny and a lot of things that we were doing uh, several years ago. Uh, so it's so exciting, man, to um, to get a call from him and uh, to, you know, for him not to forget about little old me, you know. So uh, I'm so excited to be able to um, to work with him again. We got comedian Stefan Van on the camera, you know. We got oh, uh, look oh, oh, hey, 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 listen, this is one of the comedians preaching law. <laughs> it's the second time he's coming out of the woods today. Uh, <laughs> please don't ask no questions, ladies and gentlemen. Just um, you know, go with it. Wow. 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 <laughs> yeah, so um we're gonna give him some more hand sanitizer. Hey man, come get this hand sanitizer, yeah. <laughs> Dude, we're gonna Was it worth it? Yeah, Dude, yeah. we're gonna have to get you one of them potties. I'm gonna have to travel with a potty. Get us some, 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 some diapers. <laughs> My man got a baby bladder, y'all don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. He grew up with his bladder, didn't he? I drink a lot. Yeah. A lot of water. I know. Oh, okay. Right. Water. He got an infant bladder. Wow. <laughs> well, there you have it, y'all. Hey, so What's up, everybody? Um. Stefan here. Um, it's the night before um, the Jacksonville show and I'm in the hotel room um, getting ready. I went to go see the, the club, the Comedy Zone, and uh, not bad. Actually, it's uh, a, nice, a, nice, uh, a nice venue, actually, so I'm looking forward to it. Um, got two screens and you know, for people who are sitting off to the right a little bit, you know. So, um, looking forward to it. I came in a day early um, just so that I can, you know, just prepare mentally. Um, I don't want to be trying to get traffic, you know, and come up the day of and all that stuff. I just kind of want to already be here, have my mind relaxed. And, you know, the good thing is that the comedy club is in the hotel. So it's just, you know, feet away from uh, from uh, where the where my room is and oh, excuse me. I'm so sorry. Um, and where the uh, where the comedy club is. So that helps. And to, to have seen it and know kind of what the acoustics are and, you know, meeting the, the club manager and knowing what the capabilities are and seeing what the clock is, you know, all of that stuff. Uh, I was able to kind of do early. Uh, so very good, feeling good. You know, didn't get any anxiety like I, I I thought I would. You know, I kind of felt almost like I was at home, you know, seeing that club, you know, and uh, seeing some of the open micers that were there tonight. So that was cool. I actually met a young lady uh, 
Jen. Man, you mad? I went to the dentist last week, and now you know you have that one feature about you. you have that one thing about me that's like my asset. The best thing on me is my smile. I never had a cavity. I ain't never had no braces. Everybody like you got teeth like your mom. I'm like, no, she bought hooks. <laughs> they came like that. She bought me. <laughs> These is mine. So I love my teeth. You know, I take care of my teeth and everything. But I went to the dentist, and he was like, you got a cavity. Is that? That's what I'm saying. He didn't take me into the family counseling room. He didn't call the emergency contact. I feel like somebody should have been with me when he told me. He just gonna say, like, you got a cabin. Baby, I over, I thought, oh, Lord, what stage is it? I said, how long got God down? I pulled out my phone. He was still trying to give me x-rays. He was like, what do you know? I was like, I'm calling my mama. I'm trying to get my family on. Right. Uh, who was hilarious, man. I'm looking forward to uh, working with her and bringing her um, um, to uh, to some so funny shows, you know, so that should be exciting. Um, but uh, but I'm looking forward to this, man. It's going to be fun. Looking forward to seeing Preacher tomorrow and uh, working with him. And, uh, you know, just going to do my my very best. I, I think I've prepared and, you know, I've I added a couple jokes that I'm going to do kind of based on the ambience of the room. And, and um yeah, the room ain't the best. Yeah, one of those motel rooms. Um, yeah. yeah. That's one of the things I don't miss about comedy clubs because they, they will put you in something. You know, but it's all good. It's all good. Yeah. I, I, knew, I knew what to expect. Uh, uh, long as they ain't got roaches, <laughs> I'm good. So I, I haven't seen nothing crawling, you know. I probably will keep my clothes on, you know, and I, I don't think I'll be getting un, under no sheets, though. I don't think I will be. No, no, I won't. No, I won't. I'm going to be fully clothed. Yes, I am. Fully clothed. Yes, I am. Fully. You see that? Fully. Right on top of the bed sheet. Yes, I am. So, yeah. But anywho, man, looking forward to it. It's going to be a great, a great weekend. Five shows. Um, got my supplements, got my pills. I'm ready. You know, spoke to my doctor before I left. So she kind of gave me some pointers of what to do uh, and how to do it. And um, we're just going to do it, man. So y'all just get ready, man. Take a look at, at, uh, at this process in motion, man. Five shows, first show back, 2020, Preacher Lawson Show, um, Jacksonville, Florida. Let's do it. Me and my, bu my boy, my boy, my boy, Stefan Van, we're talking to the audience. Stefan Van, when I was in Orlando, Florida, he took me on tour with him and a couple other people, some singers. There's a gospel tour, it's like the Soul Funny radio show tour or something like that. I was in Florida, he's in Florida, so I was like, hey man, come open for me, and he opened for me, and then at the end, you know, we started talking to the audience. I thought it was some funny content in here, so I was like, man, let me go and post it now. Let me go and post the video for them to see. So I let y'all do it. Love you lots. Check it out. Hope you enjoy. You can ask me right now in front of everybody, Stefan. And he's coming to, Stefan's gonna be, yeah, you can ask him a question as well. There you go. Hey, hey. Yeah. So if you have a question, you can ask us right now, and you don't have to raise your hand, just ask it, because I can't see y'all, if I'm being honest. I can't see anyone past the third row. <laughs> Why don't you ask that? Ooh, that was 20 years ago, um, and uh, my, my uh, mentor was uh, Bill Cosby before. <laughs> I mean, we'd be wild. Like, what if he was like, my mentor is Bill Cosby. Now, that's when you go, wow. You know what I mean? What do you mean, wow? What about now? Yeah, they didn't like picking it up. That's, they didn't look at it. And another time, they shut up. And they didn't bring it up. So then I heard some brother on the side. Man, sit back and call all that. And I'm like, I'm fine, so we won't. No, I do. I know he's like that. I'm fine. Every time I'm back, ain't no comic gonna kick my ass. Like this. What? 
I will fight every time. Man, they want to be right to know about talking all that shit. So, so my boy, they, 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 they,